Hey guys, welcome back. Got a, another jewelry bag. I couldn't wait to open this. This is the one I got yesterday from Thrift Giant uh, West, Northwest Highway. It was $6.99, and it was actually the only thing I bought from that store yesterday. And I um, paid full price for it. So I'm gonna do this real quick. Somebody had mentioned they couldn't see me in the video. And it's intentional. I'm only focusing on the jewelry in these videos. When I do them like this, I'm not uh, trying to be in the video. Just want y'all to see what I got. That's all. Okay. Move that over there. It's a lot of little junk. You know what? I wasn't prepared again. This is by Irwin Pearl. It says on here. It's a vintage earring. Irwin Pearl. Can you see that? It's a little love knot. Now, it doesn't have any markings where, you know, if it's gold. I don't think it's real gold anyway. But whoever that designer is, that's not bad for a vintage earring. It's a clip on. Not bad. Okay. Classy. What do we have here? Oh, this is some shiny, dull, shiny gold. Okay, no markings. And a dollar sign. <laughs> Men's ring. That's a big one. Okay. This is one of those scarf uh, holders. And it's a faux pearl, I believe, faux pearl. Yeah, ain't no pearl that big. I'm going to do the uh, challenge video. Um, Miss Alley Cat had some good questions, so I'm going to take some of hers. And if anybody else, leave a couple questions on here. If there's anything you would like to know, you know, you have an interest in knowing about other people who are doing YouTube videos, put them in there. Because I'm thinking we'll have about 10, 12 questions. So that shouldn't make too long of a video. Here's one of these. We've been getting a lot of these bracelets lately. It's like a rubberized bracelet. Uh, white plastic. Yeah. Oh, here you go. They're not the same size though. Perp, uh, like a lavender and white. I think this was in another bag I just had. The one I did over the weekend. Not the necklace. Uh, jar but the other bag it's cute it's a little pierced here and here's another one it's not the same earring but okay this broke off of something it's a little heart with a peace sign in it and the little piece right there broke off okay this is dirty fabric, so we won't be holding on to that. Got another keychain, and this is Xerox again. Remember, we got a Xerox left. Was it in Jersey? When I was in Jersey last week? Or I know I had one of these Xerox keychains. Okay, here's an earring. Oh, we had this earring. We had this earring the other night, and this is one of the ones I was looking for. That one. And I don't remember seeing this one, but that's cute, too. They're not real. And I'm, I'm looking for a maker's mark. Nah, nothing. This one I know wasn't because I checked. Uh, the other one, and it's not silver, but it's cute. I hope the lighting is good here. Okay. Just a hollowed out cross. You see that? It's almost like aluminum. Some type of metal. Hmm. Different. Another little bracelet. Rusted out. Oh gosh, who remembers these? <laughs> this is like a bright, bright orange. Got another one of these. These these are coming back. I, I was getting these in every bag for a while. Somebody must have donated that.
Then we have this uh, mustache earring. And we had one in the other bag, but I think it was a different color. Rhinestone in there. Hold up, y'all. I keep getting this message. I gotta stop this. It's messing up the video. Okay, I'm back. We got a uh, faux bead stretchy. That'd be cute for crafts. Um. And oh, Christmas tree. Uh, hook. You know what? I think it was one of these in, um, this is Jones in New York. I think it was one of these in that other bag, too. Jones, New York. Uh, it's faded out. So it's not gold, but it was just, it's a nice thick chain. Okay. I've got an earring hooked up in here. Here's one here. Okay, now. Little earring. Little old earring. Nothing much to it. Glass beads. And then we have a, um, this is a shell. at the back of it. Um, carved out into a flower. A piece of shell carved out into a flower. And then we got an earring hook. And I think we had this earring, I had this earring in another bag. That is in the house. I'm actually still sorting that. So that earring is in there. And then this is on a little fabric. I mean, thread. This money made that. Okay, I've got a bead that came loose from something. It's like a vintage bead. I don't even know what material that is. Let me see if I scooch you up a little bit, if I can get a little better there. Okay. All right. Here's an earring that is... I'm gonna say rather vintage. I'm, ooh, yeah, I would say. It had some kind of thing in there that's dry rot. Okay, it's not marked. But I would venture to say this was from the 60s. Look at that. Look at the side profile of that. How it has that uh, metal around the back beat. That's cute. I don't know what that is either. I have no idea what the material is. Some more of these bracelets, so. And these aren't bad. You know what, I think I had some of these too, with like the pieces that are set in there, like that. It's not bad. I swear I hope this video is, see, is you could see it. Because it looks so dark to me, but it always does, so. Okay, beads, some little plastic beads on um that's supposed to be made to look like uh metal but it's not another bracelet and a little dangle earring some pretty turquoise color it's not turquoise um, I don't know. It's not turquoise. It's just be colored beads and some wood beads. Oh, got some nasty hair there. Okay, what's this? Got some tangle right here. Looks like a couple cute earrings, though. Okay. Oh, that's really pretty. Look at that. That's really cute. Looks like a glass bead here. And maybe even some, I don't know, that's really pretty. It's really pretty. That's cute, I'll hold that to the side and hope I find another one of those. Another little fashion earring. Something that came free with a necklace. It's like little pink pieces on there, glittery. kind of cute not marked so gold chain it has a little tangle in it and a little peace sign with some rhinestones in it small really small Let's see what we got here oh, 
Okay, this is kind of cute. It's one of these fish necklaces and it says, I believe on it. And then it has some little sparkle pieces on there. Then we have this chain. Oh, that's cute. Too bad we missed it for the 4th of July. A little flag, United States flag on a heart with rhinestones. It's really pretty and it has all the stones. Oh wow, it's cute. Somebody might be interested in that. This is Ann Klein. Little crossy type thing, I guess, or angel. I don't know what that's supposed to be. Okay, sit her to the side. What is this? A piece of broken chain. This has been in a couple of the recent bags. Somebody broke this chain and put it in there. And, and is putting it in different bags. Because I've gotten that like two or three, in two or three bags that I've opened recently. Um, this is one of those, um, pla it's a plastic earring, but it's like that. Um, you know what I'm trying to say. Translu translucent clear. Like a frosted clear. It's cute. Uh, got a hairpin with a blue bow. Plaid. Okay, what is this? This is almost like that Coke can that I had the other day. The Coca-Cola can that somebody made a brooch out of. Okay, it's blue with pink. So I don't, this is some type of metal that they made a flower and then they uh, put pink at the tips. Not bad. All right, let's see if we have any markings on this. No, but it's really cute. It's small though, so it would just fit my wrist. Look at that. Look how thick this bracelet is. There's no markings. And look at the hook. Look how big that is. And it will hook just like this. Oops. Oops, oops, oops. That's cute. I think that's really cute. It's kind of small. And I'm in seven and a quarter wrist. So that was probably a small for um, that. Okay, we got some Aunt Louise. Nah, Aunt Louise will probably turn her nose up at these. And it's broke. So if it could be hooked back, but yeah. I don't know, these might be big light. Let me see. There's something. No, I don't. I have no idea what they are. None. <laughs> I don't know if it is or not. No, it feels too plasticky. Like, um, it doesn't feel like it. I don't know. But look at the class. It's definitely vintage. So if that other piece could be fixed, somebody might be interested. If that shrimp necklace could sell for $29.99, this could sell for at least seven. Okay. Oh, this is cute. Somebody made this in shop class and their mother gave it away. Come on, get out of here. Somebody made this in shop class. Look at that. They was feeling real religious one day and made this. It's a big old cross out of metal. And then it's on this little, um, you know, chain link thing. Gold tone. It doesn't even have a clasp. Somebody made that for Mother's Day, I guarantee you. We have these big, big giant stones. Okay, this is broke too, I see. Okay, it's supposed to go like this. Ooh, and that even just opened up on me. Wait a minute, what in the world are we dealing with here? Oh, okay, it's not necessarily. Oh, this right here, I see. What does that say? 
Oh, this is sterling. So it ain't too cheap. This class says 925. Oop, can't even get y'all to see it. it. Says it right in here, 925. So this is sterling. And then what it does is you put all of the pieces in here to make a necklace. I see, I see. And then this one. And then you go to the other side and do it too, and it'll make a necklace. And then when you add these three in, it makes a necklace. Okay, that's not bad. But the clasp is, is uh, silver. Okay, and then that's how it closes. And after you put all of the other pieces in too. Okay, set that to the side. I'll look that up and see what that's about. And then um, we have a wood necklace that has a moon. Oh, and it's made out of something. Look at the, some type of a wood or nut or something. You see how that's curved? Somebody will tell me what this is. And then this is, somebody made this straight off of an island. Because look at the clasp. It's like a cork piece, piece of wood, and it goes into a hole like that. <laughs> okay. This is an earring on here. Okay. So this is a broken chain with rhinestones. That could be used for crafts, though, because it, it is rhinestones in there. Got another one of those plastic bracelets with the white and lavender. And... This looks like one of the book things you put through your book to hold your page. It has a fly, a silver fly right here, like an insect fly. And then it has some beads on it and it goes through the book. That's cute. Silver tone faded uh, bracelet. Oh, y'all, it's hot out here. Then we have looking for any markings and I don't see any okay an earring it's got these are crystals though these are a uh, moonstone and uh, rose quartz and a couple other things that I can't pick out right one other thing I like might be a glass bead in there that dark pink ooh, ooh. see if I hold that back see there's crystals in this earring Set that to the side. And then we have, I got this in, in the other bag. This was in, I hope it's not in the bag I left in Jersey. I left two bags in Jersey for my granddaughter. Okay. Another, um, this has a little moon on it, but it's a uh, choker type thingy. You know, one of the things. But it was short, that's a skinny neck that it has to go on. Yeah, it's a small neck. Probably a teenage, teenager's thing. Um, okay, we have a brooch. Oh, no, this is an earring. Oh, my goodness, it's huge. Let me, I'm checking for markings, guys. Okay, no markings. No writing at all. Okay. Would you look at this? I thought that was a brooch. This is a non-pierced ear. Earring. Yep, here's the back. All goldy. So, ugh, y'all. This was, that was from an era ago. Okay, I know for a fact I have this earring. This is in there uh, that I was still sorting. I was hoping to find this because I know this might be sellable to somebody. I am going to sell some things. I'm not, I had, didn't put anything up yet. But once I do, I'll let you guys know. I'm taking my time and sorting through things. Okay, these are cute. I got a whole pair of these. I got to start getting rid of this jewelry. Now, I don't know if I'm going to sell... Oh, that one don't even want to open. Okay. Um, okay, these are by... Oh, wait a minute. I got to check that out. It says it's long, whoever it's by. Um, 
It's a long name. I can bet. It, and it's, it's written in there good. It's just I couldn't make out what it was. Okay, it's by... Uh, I can't make out the first letter. Is that an E? Oh, no. C-A-N. Canon. Canon I-C-U-S. Canicus. Canicus. I don't know, y'all. C-C-C. That's what this is. Lord, I couldn't get that word together there. Sorry. <laughs> and it's a pair. So, not bad. I'm going to look that company up, too. Yeah, so I don't know if I'm just going to do the bags or if I'm going to um, try to sell something separate. I don't know. I have no idea yet. Okay. I might have this. Or this might be something I left in Jersey, too. I'm not sure. I might have that in, in the house. It's a nine pairs here, too. Okay, this one, I, I have one. It's not this exact one. It's a keychain, Jumanji by Disney. This is a hippopotamus with his mouth open. The other one, I think, was a rhinoceros. I don't know. I just, I got, I knew I, I know I have it. I had it in the bag before last. Okay, we got a tag here that says Faith. And no uh, metal markings. So it's just beads. And um, the beads are plastic. Yeah. And some metal beads with rhinestones. So, I mean, it's not bad. That would be good set in a... Uh, I mean, like, you know, combined in a uh, lot. Okay, no, no name on this, but this is a pretty watch. It's really nice. You see that? It has a rubber band. Like the band is rubber. And it's like, it looks like a matte black. And then that black face with the white, and with the gold numbers. And then it has the white. That's a nice band. That's a nice watch. It's really nice. There's no name on it though. Okay. Throwback. From the 70s, early 80s. A uh, little wicker like um, bangle. Big thick one. Okay, this is what I've been looking for. This is what made me buy the bag. I looked. I have this other one in the bag I did Saturday night. And it's a moonstone. It's beautiful. Look at that large hoop. I mean, the large hook that goes into the ear. Can you see that? Cute. That's what I was looking for. And that's what I saw when I was looking in the bag. I was kind of going through it to see if I wanted it. And that, that's what made me buy it. Okay, um, a little decorative piece. Cute. Nothing major. Fashion piece. Oh, here's more of that, uh, expensive stuff. The lady was selling the earrings for $32 for. This actually, I think this goes to the one that I have on the card there that was only one. And it was, be it was being sold for... Um, $32 for the pair. So now I have it. I have the piece is off. I got to find that. But the hook that goes in the ear. Here's a ring. Octagon shape. Wait. What is it? Hexagon, maybe? Yeah, hexagon. Yo, I forget. Look, it's been a long time since I was in school. Don't hold me to it. How many people have used hexagon and octagon since they graduated from school? Nobody. Ain't even important. I don't even know why they teach us that mess. Okay, this says something too. Now, what do you say? Please say something nice. It would be so nice if it said 14 karat because it's nice and heavy. Or 18 karat. Let me see. Nope, it doesn't. It says... M-U-N-E, maybe? Moon? And then it has a whole lot of DNA on it that needs to be cleaned. Moon? M-U-N-E, maybe? Oh, it's 
get, it's coming loose. The thing is coming loose. All right. It's a little shell earring. And it's a pierced ear. So I got to clean it and see what that name really says on it. This might go to it. Looks like that thing is start trying to come loose there. Hmm. Okay. And then we have, this was a bracelet that's broken. Is this real turquoise? No. It's not real plastic. Okay. That's broken. Oh, these are cute. Uh oh. Let's check these out. Hmm. Wait a minute. Do I see anything? No, that was just wishful thinking. No, nah, no markings. Body. I thought they were silver. <laughs> All right. It's a pierced ear hoop with a braid, braided piece going down. Really dingy. I'm going to clean them up. I don't see any any markings at all on there. Here is a plastic bead. Must have came off of something. And I think I have this earring in the house too. It's not, um, it's just gold tongue. A hoop. Like an oblong hoop. Like a, you know, with a nice little curve in the back. Pierced ear. Okay. Fancy. Black stones with rhinestones. Not bad. Not marked. Nope. No markings. But cute. Oh, this is all the stuff we already saw. I forgot I put that over here. Okay, let's see what this is here. We got a bag. Oh, some earrings. Oh, they're falling apart. That's why they're in the bag. Okay. The now, what is this? This is... Uh, I thought you might have been special. This this pearl might be real. The gold doesn't appear to be real. But we got these little stones in there. So, it's red, uh, blue, red, and green. And then the pearl looks like it could be real. I'll check it. I'll test it later after I clean it. But really cute. I'll do the tooth thing after I clean it. Okay. Then we have... I don't know what this is in here. This feels like... Yeah, this is plastic. It's had me all excited like it could have been a ruby. Ain't even metal. Okay, and then these earrings. Are not marked. And the, the pieces have fell out. So that's why it was in that bag. Most of the pieces are here. It just needs one little thing there. One little black, oh no, we're missing one. But that one other one is cute. This one's cute. That one's cute. I don't see a match to it though. Okay. Here's a glass bead. Uh, Look at that bead, that's cute. glass bead earring what's this hmm. oh an owl a kid's earring let me see do I have them upright oh that way kid's earring yeah something else for a kid a little dangle heart Not some piece is broke. Whatever it is is broken off of something. Another owl earring for a kid. They're all plastic pieces. Okay, this is not marked, and I think I have this. I think I have this in the, another bag. This is a vintage too. Vintage earring too. So this is nice. It's probably from the early, very very early eighties. Okay. Huh. It's a pair of these. They're gold hoops. They're not bad. Cleaned up, they would be okay. They have a little rust spot on them. But cleaned up, that would be okay. Look at that. Pierced ear. Yeah, I like those. Okay. 
Whoa. Yeah. Okay, no markings whatsoever. But look at all that design. Ooh, black, red, and gold with rhinestones. It's a non-pierced earring. Cute. Okay, this is in the bag in the house too. It's a little flower earring. Non -pierced. It's, it's been bent. But it can be bent back, but it's all faded out. I mean, like, I don't know who would want it. Okay, this is a toe ring. With some zangle, some zangle, with some dangle on it. Purple little beads on it. Faded out. Broken pearl. Okay, what do we have here? Okay, just a little earring. And it goes in like that. See, it's a pierced ear. So it would actually go into your ear, and this would be front facing or side facing. So it's just hollow and it has like glitter on it almost. Oh, we found that other earring. Oh, no, we didn't. Very similar though. Look at that. I thought it was it, but it's not. It's cute. over here so it doesn't blow around okay oh we found this in the other bag too saturday night's bag saturday night's bag it's a non pierced ear this was in there and it's not marked another earring it's a pierced ear all of these are around from the same era, late 70s. Well, some is in early, some is in, actually in the 60s. Okay, what in the world are we looking at here? I think that's the way it's supposed to go. It's like a plastic tube, and it has like a string of gold tone and some beads on it. Bangle. Oh, gosh, remember these the other day when the, girl, the girl's friend... Lied to her and told her they was nice when they was yellow. Look, we got purple and pink, too. <laughs> I meant purple and blue. Get out of here. Okay. Oh, this is an earring, guys. Okay. What in the heavens? These are made in India. And it's brass. It looks like something's missing from the top here, though. With some metal pieces. That's not half bad. Oh, I got both of them. So I don't know if something was missing or not because neither one of them has anything on the top. Both of them. And it's a non pierced ear, so it's a clip on. And they just jingle. That's cute. They're kind of cute. They're really kind of cute. Huh. Put them in there. This must have came off of something. It's just a piece of metal. It's not a ring. It has a flat back. So it was on something. Okay, I think I have this earring too in there. I think I do. Uh -uh. Come on, come out of here, thing. Oh, and this too. Okay, how do we get this out? Oh, there you go. Remember this? It's, whatever it is, is broken off of something. And um, I have the match to it in there. And both of them are broken. So I don't know what they go to. It's like, it looks like it was an enamel earring. But then I think I have this too. Look at that odd shape. It's a pierced ear. Uh -oh. I don't know what that is. Oh my goodness. I got an alarm going on or something. What in, this phone is just crazy working by itself. Because it was off. Now I don't know how that happened. <laughs> it's crazy. Okay. So yeah, this is just like a tin, but I love the shape of that. Look at that. It almost looks like a shrimp. This can go with the shrimp necklace. Okay. Look 
Okay, and a little, I might have this in there too, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, they take, they're, what they're doing is they're taking one earring from each set and putting it in different bags. And if you're lucky enough to get it, you're lucky enough to get it. This is like a, uh, that uh, crystal-like glass bead that sparkles. A couple of just dangle beads, it's a pierced earring. Oh, this is the one I really wanted. I have this in the house. Yeah, it's not marked. No, it's not marked at all. But I just thought it was so different. Look. I had this Saturday night, too. It was a pierced ear. And then it just has that shape. I think I'm, I hope I found this one, too, because that's nice. But that one, I really like that. I'll take that in there and match it up. This is cute. This is one of the door knockers. And I think... Possible, I might have possibly found that too. Um, I think for a fact that I did find these, both of these, because I have two sizes in the house. I meant this exact earring, but in two totally different sizes. I hope it's these sizes. Check that out. Uh, you know, I love a hoop. Okay, this is a hoop, and it looks very nautical. And it's not marked. With no designer's name. But it's cute. It looks very nautical. Look at that. Orange. It has a, like an enamel paint on and with the gold showing through. It's not bad. But I don't have a match to it. Got a chandelier. This is a glass chandelier dangle. That's cute. This glass too. Another broken bead. I had one over here. Here it is. Came off of something. Another toe ring. This might be silver though. So I'm going to check this good because I got a bunch of them that are silver. That I have in my save my silver stuff pile. No, it's not. It's not marked. But it's just a little toe ring. Um, Got some earring backs. And another little dangle earring. Silver and blue beads. That's a pretty blue bead. That's a pretty blue bead. All right, what do we have here? Okay, no markings, right? Nope. Earring. Do I have one over here like this? No. I thought I saw it. Maybe it's in the house. Maybe it's, you know, it was from the bag Saturday, too. Non pierced ear. Vintage. Oops. And, um, I don't know if I saw that or not, but look at this. This is a pierced earring. And it had comes to a point like that. I thought they, I remember these. I remember they were so cute. Yeah, not marked. Oh, here's that other blue earring. I said it had a blue stone. It was pretty. They're cute. Some little dangle earring. Pierced ear. Here's that other one that looked like it was, uh... Oh, no. No, this isn't it. This isn't the same one I was looking at. But for the turquoise. It's not. This one is hooked up some kind of way. Let's see. Okay, some kind of way is stuck and twisted. But it's just a dangle earring. I have to fix it. Looks like it had some nice no, plastic beads. And another little crystal earring. Dangle. Pierced ear. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. This might be. I don't know. This might be Bakelite. I have no idea. The way that's set in there like that. It's like three... The blue and then the white set in there and then the black it might be i'm not sure okay sunglass earrings poor kid and it's a pierced dangle ear oh this we had last year i meant last last weekend saturday it's like a purpley uh star 
with some rhinestone in it. Pierce deer. All right, so what is this? Oh, this is that. We already seen this. I'm holding on to this earring. We already saw all that. And what's this? A little bow with some rhinest pink rhinestones in it. Make sure y'all can see that. And a yin and yang. And it's a pierced ear, a little tiny earring. Oh, another one that has just some, like a silver toned, uh, aged silver tone, little tiny. Yep, and no matches on those. That's just cute. One earring. A little hand. You know the hand. What's that hand? Um, in the spiritual. I can't think. I, I have no memory right now. Uh -huh. It's a little hand with a little stone in it. Uh, what's this? Oh, this is really cute. This is, this has, this is definitely silver. Yes, it is. Uh, 925. I knew it. Does that say something else on there? Let me check, guys. See, it looks like it. It's too bad I couldn't find a match. It says... can't make out what it says. Okay, 925. And then it has a letter in front of it, like a G or something. It looks like it might be the maker's mark. Whatever that letter is. Can't make it out, but that's a pretty earring. Look at that. It's pretty. And no, no match to it. Okay, but we have, this is, um, somebody's gonna tell me what this is. It goes on something, and it's, what's the stone? What's this stone? Uh, it's like a tan color, I'll think of it. No, nah, I'm sure. That's cute. And that's it. So we got two Christmas ornament hangers. And that was it for Otis. Some little flower with a plastic thing on the back. The rest of this we saw, right? Okay, yep. So, no, wait a minute. What is this? Oh, I think this is a toe ring, too, or, or some kind of ring. I don't know, but, uh, I don't know. Something. It's not silver. Okay, guys. It was fun. Got this bag done. I was out itching to get this bag done this is the one like i said i got yesterday i will um see you guys tomorrow tomorrow i know i'm gonna upload that uh, question challenge so um miss ally cat had added a couple um she had like a bunch of nice questions so i'm gonna mix some of those in and then some now here's this is the video that what i'm gonna do is depending on how many questions we have um I really don't want to go over 10 or 12 because I don't want the videos to be that long. But if somebody has a question that's like really interesting, like if you're trying to start a YouTube channel and maybe you have a question for somebody, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if we really want to even go that deep. But if somebody has a question, just submit it and we'll see what we can come up with. And I want to at least put the video out tomorrow and give a couple weeks for people to come up with their answer. So say, say we'll have it done in two weeks or something answers rather so i don't know i was thinking between five and ten questions but we started getting some good questions so um if you got any ideas leave them in this video down the bottom all right guys i'll talk to you later bye bye